Okay, I had said the last video was the very last bit of question 12a in 2017, but I was wrong. Um, there was one more small bit. A rotating object can be in equilibrium. Explain how this can happen. Okay, so what I've sketched here is some thing, some bar that is rotating. Okay, we got this going on here. Um, how can this happen? Well, our laws of equilibrium say that there is a zero net force and then there is zero um, net moments as well the upwards and the downwards equal the left and the right uh, upwards equal downwards left equal right and then there's um, any clockwise moments equal the anti-clockwise moments there is zero net forces how can this happen well it's pretty straightforward if this is constant angular velocity and there's nothing pushing on it then it is in it is in equilibrium. It's not changing. Okay, so it happens. Um, so we can say this can occur when an object has constant angular velocity. The Earth, for example, is spinning at a constant angular velocity. It's in equilibrium. There's nothing changing about it. It's just constantly in its angular velocity. Okay, spinning, spinning, spinning. Um, okay, thanks.